everyone welcome back so today's haul is a tiffany candles haul as you can see the owners are tiffany obviously and roxana um you can find their facebook page uh tiffany candles and yeah i think that's all i want to really say um i've said this in the previous videos but i guess i'll say it again tiffany candles is really revamping their image and i really love it so like um new scents new oils new blends new packaging new shapes um i'm just loving it new labels i'm just i i love everything about it and it's really nice to see everything transition and then it's like if you go to their facebook page there's like all these roses and pink and purples and pastel colors and everything's so nice and pretty and girly i really like it i like what where they're going with this <laughs> i really like it because there's a theme there and it's like kind of like it's drawing me in it's it's obviously working <laughs> it's drawing me in so yeah so um as you can see like with the labels and we'll start with this first one this is strawberry bread but you see it says home fragrance tiffany candles and it says established 2007 i love how they put established 2007 because if you don't know tiffany candles is an og for real in this wax game whether it's candles like vendor candles vendor wax Tiffany Candles has been here for quite some time. Um, 2007 was a long time ago. So just putting that out there. Um, so yeah, so Strawberry Jam Bread. This is one of those scents that you get from a lot of different vendors. Um, Strawberry Jam by itself smells a little funny and it's really hard to explain like exactly what it smells like because it's Strawberry Jam. But of course, if you went to go sniff on it, a jar of strawberry jam it might smell a little better in the jar <laughs> i don't know like but melting i think it gives more of a realistic kind of scent of strawberry jam and then i like this blend this specific blend because a lot of times the bread comes out a little bit too much for me like i like it but i always want to add a little some something else like i want to add a little bit more strawberry and i think this one hit it on the nail so i really like that one and this was available, so I don't know. I may have to check and see if that's available next for the next one. Uh, this is Amish Friendship Bread. Um, this is a, just a different type of bread scent. It's really hard to explain. Because it kind of smells like a juice. But I don't know. It's hard to explain. It smells like a, some type of like fruity bread, but it's kind of juicy. It's really, really hard to explain. That's a that's a scent that a lot of vendors have, that like Amish Friendship Bread. Like, I think it's a type, so. This is Cider Lane, Pumpkin Cupcake, Birthday Cake, and Vanilla Bean Noel. This is kind of giving you an idea of the newer shapes that they're coming out with and the kind of theme that they're starting to have. This bow is just so cute. But this one smells like a lot of Cider Lane mixed with bakery so you have the pumpkin cupcake which that pumpkin gives it a little bit more spice like maybe a little bit more cinnamon not too much cinnamon because if it was too much cinnamon i would definitely let you know um but it's like that pumpkin spice you know type of scent like nutmeg all spice that like spicy what you make pies and stuff with in the fall time um so it's like cider lane mixed with bakery basically like a spicy bakery with the pumpkin like a pumpkin spicy bakery with the side line. So that one's really good. I like it. This next one is um, Marshmallow Donut Shop and Pumpkin Cupcake. I really love Tiffany Candle's Donut Shop. It, I, even though I think I suggested Cinnamon Sugar Donuts type because I just love Cinnamon Sugar Donuts type, but I would mix like Cinnamon, cinnamon Sugar Donuts type with her Donut Shop and like Vanilla Bean Oil or, or something like something like that. So, um, I really, really like this one though. It's like spicy from the donut shop because her donut shop is a, is like cinnamony. It's like a, it's her, her donut shop smells like a cinnamon twist or like it could come in a, you know, they have it in the regular donut holes and stuff like that. But the cinnamon twist or the cinnamon donut holes, that's what it smells like. If you've ever smelled that, that's what her donut shop smells like. And then it has that pumpkin cupcake with the pumpkin spice in there. I really like that one. This is like, these are all great fall scents. And these are samples, by the way. I don't know if I mentioned that for uh, any newbies watching my channel or newbies to Tiffany Candles. All these little tiny ones are samples. Uh, but this is Country Berry Hot Cakes, Vanilla Bean Noel, and Strawberry Preserves. This is amazing. This is so good. 
Oh my gosh, it's so good. It's so like jammy and so like, uh, so good. So onto my actual purchase. I got pumpkin crunch cake with vanilla ice cream. Only reason I really feel like I got this, because normally with that crunch cake, I don't know. I don't, I don't know, because I'm not really a big fan of strawberry crunch cake, I don't think at least. Some of the blends that I've gotten uh, from other vendors I did not like. Uh, but it what intrigued me was the vanilla ice cream, but not just the vanilla ice cream, but the fact that it was the overpour. So um, for those of you who are new to wax or new to Tiffany's, um, pumpkin crunch cake is are the little uh, orange things or whatever these little chunks are and they're considered embeds and so everything you see that's white is considered the overpour and so um, pumpkin crunch cake with vanilla ice cream so I just feel like I don't have anything with a lot of vanilla ice cream like everything I have is always like this blend like all together so I kind of wanted to see what it smelled like by itself and as you, and you know when you get these you can kind of sometimes get that little piece that's by itself with just the vanilla ice cream so that's kind of what I got, why I got it, but it's really, really good. It's not as spicy as um, the pumpkin cupcake uh, scents that I have as samples or whatever. It's more like a sweet pumpkin uh, mixed with like birthday cake. Um, and normally I'm not a fan of Tiffany Candle's birthday cake, so I don't know if pumpkin crunch cake is the scent or if it's like a pumpkin crunch well, I think pumpkin crunch cake is the scent, but I get a lot of that buttery nice birthday cake and i really love a nice buttery uh just you can tell that it's like this delicious birthday cake but it's like the i don't know but that's what i'm getting from the pumpkin crunch cake which is exciting me because that's my favorite type of birthday cake like when it's buttery and nice and it almost smells like the real thing that's my favorite type and so then you have the vanilla ice cream overboard and it just creams it out and it's very authentic actually um, it legit smells like vanilla ice cream. Like if you actually went to go smell vanilla ice cream, that's what it smells like. But this is the chunk. And as you can see, everything is like this kind of in there. And this one is really, really good. I'm so happy I got this one. I like these smaller options because, um, that way I can request it into, um, bigger, you know, the bakery bags and stuff like that if I really like them and try them out. So I, I appreciate when vendors have those smaller options that we can try. This next one is Blueberry Danish Butter Cookies with Marshmallow Noel Overpour. So Blueberry, if you look at my videos, Blueberry is not a scent that you see me haul very much. It's not a scent you see me haul. Um, I think beginning, maybe in my earlier times of uh, filming videos, and I do like Blueberry, do not get me wrong. I just kind of, it's like one of those fall scents for me. It, I do like blueberry. There are scents that I like with blueberry, and there are vendors that I really like that have blueberry scents that are I can melt all year round, and I kind of almost low-key kind of hoard them. Um, but you don't see it a lot on my channel. You don't see me haul it. You don't see it in my empties. It's because I feel like blueberries just kind of like fall. And special, not special occasion, but like, I really have to be in the mood for blueberry. I like blueberry, but I have to be in the mood for it. But I normally am in the mood for it during the fall time or when it's really cold outside. And some people might say blueberry is like a summer scent or a springtime scent, right? Anyway, this smells so good. It smells like a nice blueberry. You can get that Danish butter cookie, which is very similar to sugar cookie, but it's like a different type of smell, just like a an actual Danish butter cookie tastes like a sugar cookie, but it's a little different. It's like a, I want to say coconutty, but y'all know I don't like coconut. So it's not coconut, but it's just good. And then you get the marshmallow vanilla bean Noel. I really love that um, she did the marshmallow and the vanilla bean Noel. I love that vendors use vanilla bean Noel. Like whoever that first person was who knew that vanilla bean Noel from Bath and Body Works was going to be an amazing mixer is kudos to you you know what i'm saying it might be tiffany because she's been around since 2007 <laughs> so like i just i don't know and it's mixed with that marshmallow it's not too sweet and it's just it's like a nice over pour type of scent this is not going to be too sweet and that's a lot of times what i get scared of with vendors i get scared that some of their scents are going to be way too sweet for me especially when they're throwing in 
ooey gooey marshmallow and this marshmallow, I don't know. And this, what is another one that's super sweet? Sometimes buttercream frosting can be way too sweet. But this one is good. This one is really good. If you are a blueberry liker lover, that was a good one. This one is so good. It's Donut Shop and Cookie Craze with sugar, sugar cookie dough overpour. So pretty much the little chunks you see in this is going to be the Donut Shop and the Cookie Craze. And the overpour is sugar cookie dough, like that darker brown sugar cookie dough. This smells amazing. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It reminds me of one of my favorite scents, but I ain't gonna, I'm not going to say what the scent is because I could be wrong and I'm not even going to play y'all like that right now. So, oh my goodness, it's just a little spicier. If you know my favorite, like one of my favorite, 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 favorite scents, you know what I'm thinking about. I ain't going to say it until I can confirm it, but... If that is the case, let's just say Tiffany has a little bit better throw. Oh man, this smells good. It's just a little spicy from that donut shop, but on cold, it smells amazing. And I've just been loving sugar cookie dough. Oh my gosh. I've been loving sugar cookie dough. I just want to, uh, you know what will be good in this as well? Cream cheese frosting. Oh my gosh. Or maybe sugar cookie dough cookie craze and cream cheese frosting. I don't know. I just, I've been loving cream cheese frosting too. And I know my other videos would say otherwise, but I just have discovered that I really, really love cream cheese frosting. Um, so onto the bakery bags, like look how sleek these black bakery bags are with the nice sleek like label. Oh my gosh. So this is strawberry Danish butter cookies and buttercream frosting. These are the new shapes. They are so cute. So you still have the luxury, and this is really big to me. Um, vendors, if you're listening, um, I love loaves. I love shapes. I, I Trust me, I love them. I really do. But I also really love, oh my gosh, when I can just go into my bag, grab one shape, boom, bow, put it in my warmer, and be good to go. So these are, these are pretty much all the shapes that are in there with the different colors. Oh my gosh. The shapes are gorgeous. This scent is amazing. The strawberry is definitely like a fresh picked strawberry. Tiffany Candle strawberry is so good. And I know it's that same, it's a fresh picked strawberry that a lot of people use. And I don't know, I could be wrong, but I think Tiffany Candles may have been, um, I mean, she has been around like the longest. Um, but I want to say she's the first person that ever used that strawberry. Oh, so it's that nice kind of tart, Fresh picked strawberry um, mixed with that Danish butter cookie. Again, it's just like a sugar cookie, but like better. I don't know. I'm really, this is the first time I'm getting Danish butter cookie, I think. I might have had a sample of a mixture, but it's so good. Mixed with the buttercream frosting. Oh my gosh. I can't stop sniffing it. This one is so good. This may give that strawberry waffle cone peeps cake one that I have, or peeps, whatever it's called that I have that I always rave about from Tiffany Kim may give that one a run for its money. So this one is so, so, so good. Such a good strawberry bakery. Ugh, that one, it's so good. I would recommend. Do you like strawberry? Let's do this one first. This is the pumpkin cupcake and whipped cream. So I thought this was pumpkin cupcake tight from Bath and Body Works, but it does not smell like that on cold. And I love pumpkin cupcake type, so um, I may have to suggest the pumpkin cupcake type. Um, but this one's really good too. This is like just a, but it's just a nice, it's kind of creamy, like a cream. I mean, it could be from the whipped cream, I don't know. But it's like a creamy, nice creamy pumpkin, sweet, but kind of spicy. Kinda, it's the same pumpkin that has been in all the scents. Um, like this Cider Lane Pumpkin Cupcake one, and then this sample with the Marshmallow Donut Shop Pumpkin Cupcake. But these are the mini cubes. These I like, but I, I have to grab multiple of them. It's not as easy as just grabbing the shape and going. I know it sounds stupid, but... Oh, this one smells good, though. This is a nice fall time blend. Getting, like, closer to Halloween. You can even do this, like, during Thanksgiving. 
And it's a huge bag. I, I don't know how much these bags weigh, but this feels super heavy. But it's like a creamy pumpkin cupcake scent. I, I like it. Um, perfect for like November. I want to say this will be perfect for November or even like Thanksgiving when people come over. This one I have been wanting to try for so long. It's the Cafe Con Leche and it's Old Town Bake. Gosh, I can't. I was like saying it as if the name of this blend was Cafe Con Leche, but that's the name of, that is a scent. Anyway, this is Caf, Cafe Con Leche, Old Town Bake Shop, and Marshmallow. This is good. Coffee lovers. Let me show you the shapes first because there's one new shape in here that we haven't seen yet. So these are the shapes. Super cute, super cute shapes. Um, this is a good coffee scent on cold. And I have to say on cold because sometimes I love it on cold and then melting, I'm like, oh no, too sweet or too bitter. Um, but that these bags feel really, really heavy. But this one smells good. So all you coffee lovers, Ramona, Ramona. <laughs> I hate to make you go down this rabbit hole, but this is, this blend is everything. The Cafe Con Leche is not too bad, like not too sweet. Um, it's really good actually. But mixed with that Old Town Bake Shop and the marshmallow, Old Town Bake Shop smells like a bakery, but like it has a bunch of different stuff, like cakes, cookies, donuts, bread, just like a nice bake shop. And this is such a good scent. Coffee lovers, I'm telling you. I'm gonna melt it first, let me, okay. Like I keep speaking out of out of turn like i need to calm down i will melt it and let you guys know because <laughs> i don't want y'all to go in but on cold this smells amazing Cafe con leche. It smells amazing um so that is my haul for tiffany candles thank you guys so much for watching and i will talk to you guys in a later video bye guys